knowledge back then. They didn't have a lot of stuff. I know. So, Adam, you complain about my toilet. Would you be able to go on that? Who <laughs> 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 Oh man. <clears throat> a girls dormitory at Palm Beach Atlantic and when we brought the house here we decided to restore it to its opening not to its 1920 on but to 1905 which meant hey it was a little cheaper we didn't have to put water in yeah um, and also because I think the original plan was to fake a 1920s bathroom in here but we ran out of funds. Now, here's the story of Joseph, um, who was an, go the itinerant, no. he was an itinerant worker that Those floorboards. Um, the family hired, and he got into some financial troubles and eventually hung himself in the attic. Damn. And Louise Riddle herself, yeah, Louise Riddle herself, who lived here with her husband Carl in 1920 to 1923, reported after Joseph died uh, servants started quitting and they ended up not being able to keep servants in the house because they kept hearing what they said sounded like chains being dragged up and down the stairs wow. they heard murmuring they heard music wow and just before the fair opened I'm I don't make things up um, and this house is so active you really don't even need to make things up um, a lady sure. was up here alone uh, before the fair. She was the only one in the house, and she said, do you mind if I go upstairs? I was doing something, and I said, yes, I'll be up in one minute. And she came upstairs, and uh, I came upstairs, and she was like, I, I, I really love it up here. I love that you have music playing from the 20s in the walk-through closet. That's a really nice touch, to which I replied, wow. there's no music playing. And she said, N -n no, there's <laughs> music in there. Amazing. I heard music, that's clearly. Awesome. And I was like, well, guess what? That's been reported since Joseph offed himself in the early 20s. That's one of the three things people hear. Murmuring, loud noises, including chains, um, and crashes in the kitchen. Wow. Yeah, so. So for tomorrow night, do they open that up for the no. ghost hunting? No. no. I'm, I'm working on it. <laughs> I, I'm working on it because when I first started coming here, the attic was open. You couldn't walk around in the attic. Yeah. But you could climb the stairs, and from the top of the stairs, you could look at yeah. the attic. And I just brought it up today and said, we have to go back to that. Yeah. We it's have to go back yeah. to that. Yes. Yeah, because people are so And although, in ghost stuff historically, today. historically, women mostly tend to sometimes get their hair yanked on as oh, they go no. up these stairs. <laughs> um... But I, I think people who want to go to the attic would be prepared for anything that might yeah. happen. I mean, if somebody... You just put a warning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And don't have a whole bunch of people so that if right. one person at the top freaks out and goes, Wah! <laughs> Six people <laughs> don't die falling down yep. the stairs. But this <laughs> is one of my biggest goals in, in being the new curator for this house. I'm not the official curator. But I, I spoke to Connie today about my desires to, to curate for real. And the first thing I want to do, other than upgrade some furniture, add fireplaces where we had them, because we had great connections in the theater. I spent 50 years as a set designer. Awesome. And, and wow. uh, carpenter. 
uh, and a stage manager and a director and a producer, all that stuff. Wow. Um, yeah, me too. I worked I worked there when Burt Reynolds owned it. Yeah, I was there. Wow. Ah, I worked there when it was Jupiter Theater. What'd you do? I was a maintenance guy for the most part, but I did wait sometimes oh during the Vita and, uh, uh, you know, there's a bunch of plays that I have to yeah. memorize. But yeah, of course. Um, the, yeah. Paulette was the uh, general. Oh, manager. yeah, yeah. yeah I remember remember those Paulette days. was yeah, the yeah. reason I moved down here uh, to open Charlie's Crab in Jupiter. Oh, thank you for that. Locked it's locked and it's gone, and oh. she's dead now. Oh, dear. She got killed in a car crash, and her husband died a month earlier. Cancer. She was so distraught, though, she wasn't concentrating, and she hit one of those guidelines that hold the phone poles. They hit one of those and flipped over. You know what's sad is you guys don't have the original door on the house. I know it's not the original door. Uh, one thing I do know is it's the original hinges. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> I mean, that door weighs 47,610 tons. It's solid, solid wood. Though I agree with you, I don't think it's the original door, but yeah. I don't know. But when you go out, look at the hinges, the mm -hmm. hinges are definitely the original hinges. Wow. Yeah. Well, that's good. Uh, You'd think they that would be the, the first thing they would discard is the hinges. <laughs> well, yeah. it's, it's the original it's, plate here, too. Yeah, it is. yeah. I have yeah. all that well, stuff. And we got all those other doors. Yeah. Oh, yep. and and got a oh, yeah. And I've got to point out one of these plates that it, I've been in this house... 20 hours a week for almost a year and I just discovered something the other day and went, oh my god! I never knew that. And it's downstairs, I'll just point it out. All right. Okay. But that's it. That's our house. Wow. <clears throat> that's where we want to go. Uh, I want to see if I can hear the music. They, both. they, wanna, gonna they be, really want to go. I'm going to be whining at the powers that be because guess what? I'm a volunteer. I have nothing to that's right. <laughs> they can't fire me. Yeah. And if they say, no, it's too dangerous, I'll say, well, it wasn't too dangerous 30 years ago. Mm -hmm. What well, made it dangerous now? Because people are crying. Because, now. Of, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you leave it up you. to my discretion to let people right. into the attic. <laughs> right. You know? Are you, are you guys coming back for the ghost thing tomorrow night? I think so. I did one. Yeah, I think so. Creeped okay. out beyond belief. Here's what happened at the end of it. There were about 12 of us. Nobody knew me. I got to go for free because I'm a volunteer here. So that's because I, I wasn't going to pay $35 when I haven't worked for almost two years. Now I'm retired, right. so I could. I just retired for, Tuesday. Yeah. That yeah. was my last day. I retired about two weeks ago. Yeah. We definitely got it. Um, but we were all sitting on the steps, and they had this thing called a spirit box. Do you yes. Have you heard of that? Yes. Mm -hmm. So we have the necrophonic they, they finished by saying, okay, does anybody have any questions? Do you anybody want to see if they can talk to anybody or whatever? And somebody said, ask Joseph if he wants to say hi to anybody. And the spirit box, wait, Jim, and that's my name. Hi, Jim. Yeah, I was like, no. And the people, they didn't know me. They were like, it said Jim. It said Jim. Is there a Jim here? Who's Jim? It said Jim. And I was like, <laughs> why don't you put your... But he said hi to me, apparently. Yeah, he likes you. Why don't you put yours on and ask some questions? We, I spend a lot of time defending Joseph. He should like me. Do you want to? Yeah, your phone's Do you want us? Dead. Well, yeah, my phone's dead. I was gonna use the yeah, app. I do have it on mine. Do you, do what you want. I also have. Be like Cartman. Do what you want. <laughs> Tomorrow is gonna be a day where probably a lot of people are gonna purse. be here. <laughs> cool. Everyone should travel with Dustin. Yes. I just said it. Yes. <laughs> well, those are for finding water, aren't they? Yes, but you can also use it to communicate with spirits. Oh boy! Yep. Yeah, do that. My mother. Do that up there. Get this. Here, let's do it real I, quick with the dowsing yeah. rods. I grew up with a mom who knew when the phone was going to ring, mm -hmm. and she would literally say, "I'll get it." And start walking for the phone, and then it would ring. My whole life. I'll get it. 
Mom, it didn't ring. I, it happens to me sometimes. And then she's like, it. Rang. You just didn't hear and the I, first ring. I'll say, did you hear the phone ring? And she'll be like, no. And I'm like, and then, all of a sudden, and then it phone it rings. Sometimes that does happen to me. But I've seen, but like, I've witch. seen a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> well, my mother was very psychic. My my mother my mother saw and spoke to dead people, and she was so not crazy. Have you seen anything? She was so. I haven't seen anything yet. I would. That's why I was. You must be hiding. I've I'm seen a lot of stuff. I'm afraid that I've maybe scared them away by being so friendly and working so hard on making the house really look good. Because when I, think I it's took the over opposite. the house eight months ago, <laughs> they're letting you do that. It looked like crap. They're waiting it out. I and I, I, the is first thing I did out? here, yes, this is where the air okay. hits the most. Okay. Yeah. It's not a cold spot. Okay. Well, I mean, it is, but it's because they that's put them in the, the ceiling. Yeah. Right, it's, yeah I'm sorry. It's okay, right there it's and coming. It goes junk this way. Yeah. There. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. There's no. Bad. But I, I was feeling tell it you, really cold on my back. You. I was like, oh my gosh. When you came into this room, you described something that about but I started keeping track. Of. About one out of every thirty-five people or so that come through this room have some sort of a physical reaction. Many walk through the door and go, oh, man, I just got a splitting headache. And I say, I was also dizzy. step outside, and they step outside and go, oh, my, excuse me. They didn't burp when they said it. <laughs> but they said, oh, my God, it's totally gone. And I said, so come back in. And they walk through the door and go, ah, no, nope, can't be in this room. Yeah, I actually felt dizzy. And we we have that in this room as well, and we have people in the in mom and dad's bedroom who feel oppressed. They they're like, oh my, I can't breathe in here. I I cannot breathe in this Wait, room. Which room was it? Because I put it. This one. This one here. Yeah. I actually <laughs> that was happening to me. Really? Yeah. Because it, it I, I mean it happens it, it happens it's so much. Thank you so much. You are welcome. Really. I'm, it's a joy to take people through who are sincerely interested and, frankly, <laughs> who are believers because there's too much action in this house. They're using the dowsing oh, rods. Yeah. See? You didn't even ask a question. Jeez. <laughs> Did you feel anything? That. There was like electricity in, in this one. Hello, I just would like to ask some questions. Um, is there anyone here with us? If you could cross it for yes or open for no. Is Joseph here? That one on the right seemed like it's moving a little bit, but not really like the first time. Uh-oh. You have notifications on your phone. Yeah, it's not moving. I think you got to ask it differently. Okay. <laughs> ask, okay, here's the thing. A lady in period dress has been seen in this room okay. sitting on the bed. What's her name? I don't know. I wish I knew. Is there a lady here? Can you cross for yes or open for no? Cross the rods. Cross the rods if there's a lady in this room. It's not moving. It moved immediately when you went in there. Yeah. Sometimes it takes a minute. Maybe. It's like slightly moving, but not really. Hmm. It's not doing it. Maybe they ran out when they came in and they, they blew it. Can you point to where you're at with the end of the rod? Mm. They're not really moving. 
I think you should come over by this door here. Yeah, maybe if you stand right here. Come over here Joseph and up. Because Joseph is up here. And there's a little boy in this room. The only problem that I have with that is from what I have felt mm -hmm. in the past. Oh, okay. When people say it's a yes. child I spirit, yeah. I think it might be worse than oh, that. I don't think it's a child. Oh. See, look at that. It moved immediately. I don't think it's a child. Hello. Are you are you Joseph? Can you move one of these rods if you're Joseph? No. <gasps> it's moving. Oh my god. Oh my god. Are you touching them together? It's touching them together. There is definitely something in that room. Yeah. Wow. 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 Thank you so much. Joseph, I know that you were innocent of whatever you were accused of. I know it. Wow. That's amazing. Okay, can you put it back to... Neutral, open it back up. Please. Joseph. Hmm, it's doing, it's moving. It's moving. Wow. Joseph, we respect and yes. honor your memory. Thank you so much. I can see it. I can see something touching it. It's like a, right here. It's like around it, right like this. There's like a shadow. I can see it. Thank you so much. Oh my God. Thank I can you. definitely see it. Wow. Is it showing up on video? It's like a, sort of like a, a dark-ish, shadow-ish, moving around here. You, what did you say? He's, he's, he's died before. Well, I, I was hit in the head with a brick when I was a child mm -hmm. by my brother by accident. Well, and I, I was unconscious for over 10 minutes, and then I just came right back. And I never went to the hospital. We never told my parents about it. So now I see different things, and they say that it's my mind creating things, but I don't believe that. I know I see, I can no, see spirits. I, I, I think what you're experiencing is is an almost common reaction I can see to those that. types of injuries. Those types of injuries, I think, often I can see open hand. you up. Yes. All day long, I can see a hand right there, just trying to touch it. Okay. Thank you so uh, much, is there Joseph. Do you want to ask him? Do, do you? How do how do we get a yes? Put the put the rods together. If it's okay that I'm going to come up in the attic and look around in a week or so. I see it moving. The mist is like moving, but wow. Hmm. I can see something here. They are definitely. Definitely moving more together. I'll take that as an it's okay. He's touching that one now. Yeah, that's moving. Wow. Wow. Thank you, Joseph. Oh, he's moving this one. I feel it. He's trying to cross them together, and it's not easy because it's this hard. is a spiritual Thank you so much. Being trying to move a physical object. Yeah. So I could absolutely see that it might be difficult for him to do. Yeah. Thank you so much for Thank doing that you. for us today. We will be back. We'll be back tomorrow to visit you. Ask you some more questions. Is that okay? I'm going to open this back up and you cross it. If that's okay, if we could come back tomorrow. Wow. You could open it up if that's not okay. So if we could come back and visit you tomorrow. It's kind of like flowing, the energy. 
Okay, we'll come back tomorrow and visit you. Wow. Oh my gosh. Something just touched me on my hand, I think. Not an uncommon thing it's to happen. It's now very cold on my this side right here. It is cold over here. And up here. Wow. It's pointing at me. Mm -hmm. You like him. Did you, did you Are you glad him? that Jim is here? Are you... Do you like Jim being here, taking care of the house? That had to be outside. Yeah, it was. It cat. sounded like a cat. I was gonna say, yeah. oh yay! He likes you, Jim. He likes That's you. That's great. I knew that when you said my name, although I didn't want to believe it. I was like, no, it didn't say Jim. It sounded no, and everyone was like, no. Plain as day, it said Jim. <laughs> I was like, that's not the answer I want, really. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you, Joseph. Thank you. We honor your spirit and your memory. Feel. I can hear him. Feel, feel. Oh, wow. Feel. I just heard something. Freezing. That's a tip. Yeah. Wow. You want to feel it? Wow. That was amazing. <laughs> Hello. Like Thank you so much. I mean, touching it, but it was mm -hmm. Wow. This is amazing. All right. You guys, you just <laughs> saved my day.